let's walk through the difference between site sales pages and building pages or landing pages that you create through page builder that you use as a sales page so first off the sales pages if you go into kajabi assistant and type in sales it will take you to your sales pages. These are actually found by going through products and offers and then sales pages. Now, the sales pages, the aesthetic look of them is determined by the active website theme you have on your Kajabi site, whether you are using the website or not. So whatever theme you have turned on for your website, that determines the look and what you're able to build for your sales pages. So that's why they're called site sales pages. And when they are here, okay, you can attach different offers to them. So if you have for instance, this is on my test site. We were doing multiple currencies. And so I can stack, you can see there's two different offers that are stacked or included on this sales page. I could also add another offer. So if you have different things that are all part of the same sales page, you can add more than one. And let's see if we can get a quick preview of this sales page. We're gonna hold down the command key and then click preview. That will open in a new window and you can see this is what it looks like. So I have not written anything on this. It is a test site, but you can see it has pricing options and it would go to these individual pages if I wanted to purchase the offer. So that is a site sales page. So let's go back to the admin back in the back oh what i'm trying to say the back end of our sites and here on this sales page down here at the bottom or on the right hand right hand corner it says redirect okay now you can redirect this site sales page to any of your landing pages now landing pages are anything that's coming out of page builder so i tend to call it a building page when i'm working with it because it was really hard to say landing page when there wasn't an opt-in but whatever you would like to call the page it's coming out of what page builder creates so you can select that landing page and we will click save so the reason for the redirect is that the site sales pages pull into your store. So if you do forward slash store in your navigation menu or going back over here to your website, this, the functionality of your store and how you get pages to show up in your store, again, without custom coding anything. I don't have custom code, so I know that you can achieve all kinds of different functionality by doing custom code, but the reason that I like Kajabi is that I don't have to custom code anything, so that's what I'm showing you is how it is, how it is built, um, because it just keeps life easy. So here's the store and you'll see the sales pages that I have marked as visible are showing up in the store. The other place that this now shows up is if we go back to our sites and we go into website, we're going to look at the library because the library now has the ability to separate and have two different sections of products that your customers currently own and recommended products. So they show up in two different areas now. Let's take a quick look at that because this allows people when they're in your library, if you want to show them different products to buy, that you know, the next, hey, you have this and hey, look at this, then what is pulling in 
for the recommended courses are buttons that have a sales page. So that is why there is a difference between the site sales pages and then the pages that come out of Page Builder. I call them building pages. You can call them landing pages that you're using as a sales page. They're all the same thing. It's just a page and we can do anything we want to with it in Kajabi that can redirect, sales page can redirect to where you want it to go. So that way you can have the functionality of having your library be able to split into products you own and recommended courses. If you have any questions, please let me know. I am more than glad to help you and have fun with this. It's a really cool feature that you can use to, again, serve your customers even better. Have a great day and I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.